Mm-mm. All right, well, hey, we all got to cool off somehow these days, Dave. That's right. <laughs> I guess I don't think that's the best way to do it, but uh, nonetheless, yeah, we're going to start getting more humid again, and it's starting to get a little hot out there, especially next week. Today, though, very similar to what we saw in the last couple of days. Right now, starting off, a little bit of some haze, partly cloudy out there. Temperature 74 degrees, dew point still in the upper 60s, so it's not as humid as we have been in the past, but we'll see those dew point numbers climb back in the 70s for the weekend. It's 70 Alex City, back down to Clanton. Good morning to you. Tuscaloosa 77, 70 there in Hamilton, no upper 50s like we saw a couple mornings ago. 73 in Coleman, 71 degrees for you over in Aniston and a few 60s from Gadsden, Asheville back to Talladega this morning. But overall, though, we are still looking at uh, uh, the dew point numbers into the upper 60s to lower 70s, a little more humid off to the west per usual there. So kind of on the muggy to more or less oppressive side of things. And as we look ahead uh, throughout the day, we're going to see this cloudy skies kind of building on in a mid to lower 70s this morning to 80 degrees by 10 o'clock. On our way up to about 88 again here. 90 Talladega, 88 Gadsden, 89 there in Tuscaloosa, maybe 91 few in Moundville. Alabaster Clanton, about 88 degrees today. And again, on average, we should be 91 this time of year. We have some cloud cover moving through. No rain. Had a couple sprinkles earlier this morning when I came in to work, but most of those have now cleared out. Less humid air is building back to the north. Low down along the coastline. That's going to start drawing back up that humid air back to the region here with the southeasterly winds today. And a little upper level of disturbance kind of working its way through parts of Mississippi. Mississippi. That's going to creep its way into Alabama, and that's going to have to spark off that chance for rain today as well, too, as that tropical moisture from that system builds on in through Saturday morning. It kind of lingers as we head through the weekend, then deeper tropical moisture coming in as we head into the first part of next week. So still going to be kind of in the muggy depressive category today, tomorrow, but then oppressive for sure as we head into next week. And check this out. High temperatures back in the 90s starting Sunday. And look at that heat index back in the 100s. So here comes that heat just like we had last week. Now, the Chance of rain around 30% today, tomorrow, a little lower Sunday, going back up as we head into next week with your typical pop up afternoon variety showers and thunderstorms. So, starting at lunchtime today, we will see a few of those showers, a few rumbles of thunder out there. Best chance for rain is really going to be I 65 west today as the disturbance moves on in through the afternoon hours. Coleman, Jasper, Fayette, Hamilton, through Tuscaloosa, Moundville, including here in Birmingham. Even this evening by 7 o'clock, if you're going out to a date night, just keep that in mind. A little bit of wet weather out there. Still looking at some rain by 10 o'clock tonight, but dissipates overnight. Night. And as we head on into tomorrow afternoon, we will see more across the entire area of Alabama as that little upper level of trough moves through, dealing with their scattered showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder, and they'll taper off as we head on into Sunday morning. So, spotty storms today, tomorrow highs in the upper 80s, 90s on Sunday, then here comes the hot, humid weather next week. Highs in the 90s, heat index in the 100s, with a day the chance of those pop up afternoon storms. All right, thank you very much.